I think it's going to be sooner than we expect, like probably in the next couple of years. And I think two years, two years is good. I would estimate uh, five to seven. I'm guessing maybe 10 years. Yeah, 15 years. 15 years. Yeah. There are a lot of cars, as we mentioned, a billion on the road, 100 million sold each year. It's going to take an enormous, enormous amount of engineering to transform the entire automotive industry. At CES in Las Vegas, the question on everyone's mind this year, when will self-driving cars hit the road? The phenomenon of the autonomous vehicle will impact us in the exact same way that the invention of the combustion engine did. Different people are saying different things. We're targeting 2021. We think we'll be amongst the leaders, maybe not the first, but certainly not the last. While Ford is designing its first fully autonomous vehicle to operate without a steering wheel, gas, or brake pedal, Israeli tech company Mobileye is building a collision detection system for self-driving cars. It's important to know that we don't really expect that those first vehicles will be approved for use everywhere. Those vehicles will be deployed into rideshare fleets. They'll very likely have a trained monitor in the driver's seat in case anything goes wrong. Industry analysts say consumer sales for self-driving vehicles are far down the road, and in the meantime, significant hurdles remain. Welcome back, Peter. Thanks for choosing our service again. Based on your former rentals, your insurance self-driving score is 92. Excellent driver. MarketWatch hailed a ride in a semi-autonomous car set up for ride hailing. Okay, let's go to Westgate. Estimated time will be five minutes. There's still technology challenges. We're still working through the development of the center technology. Would you like to purchase an entertainment Wi-Fi package for the journey? Yes, two gigabyte, please. I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. Two gigabyte, please. I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. That's the question that everybody uh, is asking themselves, including me. The autonomous cars uh, at scale, available to everybody, fully autonomous, we're, we're ways out. So now the car is driving and we will get directly now the pedestrian warning. So there's a pedestrian walking um, towards the street, as you can see with the NXP back here. A person here. is located on or close to the road. I think virtually every sector is going to be affected by the way people and goods are going to be transported in the future. It's not a question of if, it's a question of when, right? How quickly we get there remains to be seen. We think that in the 2030 time frame, 20% of all miles driven in the United States will be autonomous. Your self-driving score for this trip was rated 90. Your overall score remains 92. Not bad. Compared with other drivers, your behavior is slightly more risky. Please check driver coaching. <laughs>